Judge Scorch's Mueller probe, what is punishment when FBI lies to us? Matt Drudge, editor and founder of the Internet News Powerhouse Drudge Report, put the special counsel probe on notice Saturday. In a flurry of tweets, stark against an otherwise empty Twitter page, Drudge has a habit of deleting his prior tweets, the influential but reclusive conservative figure painted Robert Mueller and his Russia inquiry team as a farce. Mueller's secretive grand jury made up of residents from D.C., where 91% voted for Hillary, he began, referring to the grand jury Mueller put together to investigate possible collusion between the Trump campaign and the Kremlin. Mueller's secretive grand jury made up of residents from D.C., where 91% voted for Hillary. Matt Drudge, at Drudge, December 3, 2017. His tweet came a day after Mike Flynn. President Trump's former national security adviser, pleaded guilty in federal court to lying to the FBI about his talks with Russian officials. In the run-up to Friday's bombshell, prosecutors had canceled scheduled grand jury testimony related to Flynn. The grand jury in Washington already had indicted former Trump campaign manager Paul Manafort and his former associate for crimes related to their lobbying work abroad. Drudge's brief Twitter rant then referred to a story reported by the Washington Examiner, about how Rep. Devin Nunes, chairman of the House Intelligence Committee, is threatening contempt of Congress in response to the FBI and Department of Justice keeping the committee in the dark over why Mueller kicked a key supervising FBI agent off the Trump-Russia investigation amid concerns of anti-Trump bias. We know what happens when one lies to the FBI, Drudge said. But what is the punishment when the FBI lies to us? Turning his sights to former President Barack Obama, who is traveling around the world, meeting leaders in France, India, and China, Drudge brought up the archaic claw that could mean trouble for Flynn. Is citizen Obama violating the Logan Act when he lobbies foreign governments and world leaders against America's current foreign policy? Drudge queried. There has been chatter about Flynn possibly violating the Logan Act for talking with the Russian ambassador about sanctions while he was a private citizen during the presidential transition period. However, the grounds for what the 1799 law dictates would be a felony or untested as it has never been enforced. Drudge ended his Twitter train of thought musing on how Mueller will eventually interview Trump himself and that the spectacle should be broadcast live, an idea he has floated in the past. Mueller's eventual interview with President Trump will be a spectacle, should be broadcast live, Matt Drudge, at Drudge, December 3, 2017. The Drudge Report, a news aggregation website, is one of the most viewed sites on the Internet. Drudge also has over half a million followers on Twitter. Twitter